Hello Capricorns, welcome back to my channel. This is Divine Balance, my name is Carmen. I'm going to be doing your reading for November. This is a general reading for Capricorn, so do take what resonates, leave the rest. Switch the roles if you have to. Do not pay attention to the gender on the cards. We all have masculine and feminine energy, okay? All further information is in the description box below. So let's get started, okay? Okay. Let's see what your energy is going to be for the month of November. Okay. Um, for some reason, I heard February. I don't know why, but you know. Uh, let's see. Spirit, what is the overall energy going to be for Capricorns in November, please? Death card. Could be change and transformation going on. Uh, strength. Is at the bottom of the deck? Have the, um, and you're going to need strength for this, you know, for the, this change and transformation, this shift that you have, uh, that you may have going on. Uh, let me see. Let's see what's happening with, in your career. What's going on in Capricorn's career spirit? Come through if you will, please. What is going on in Capricorn's career for the month of November, please? Capricorn's career. for your career um all right so we got voice uh get your message heard and get noticed you have much to share with the world consider careers in radio public relations or anything in communications the only thing holding you back is your inability to speak your truth so speak your truth capricorn say what you mean be what you say let it come out clearly yeah, outlook here. Uh, improve your relationship with money to help grow your wealth. You may have conflicting values that impose negativity. Excuse me. You may have conflicting values that impose negatively on your values around money. Change behavior and develop better money habits. So instead of spending freely, be smart about what it is that you're going to buy. If you just bought a pair of shoes and the mother shoes is in the same color, it can wait. Okay? It can wait. Be smart about your money. Um perfection give up your perfectionism it's causing delays in your finances you will never get ahead if you don't overcome the fear of failure you are enough and have what it takes to improve your finances your money ain't right capricorn okay you don't have to be perfect about anything that you're doing but just improve improvement Fear, overcoming the feel of fa fear of failure. Say that three times fast. Overcoming that. What if I don't? I ain't going to do it because this ain't going to happen right. Blah, blah, blah. Overcome that as well. You are capable of accomplishing anything that you set your mind to. Look at this. Take action. Yes. Whatever your question that is telling you to go for it. Whatever your question this is telling you to go for it. Do not procrastinate or wait to take that next step to get ahead. Just do it. Nothing will change if you don't take action. Don't let opportunity pass you by. So speak your mind. Speak your, use your voice to let people know what it is that you want to do. Take action towards it. Nobody's going to know until you do it. Unexpected. Prepare for unexpected financial loss. This financial crisis may be out of your control, but you can still control the outcome. Deal with things head on and try to prepare for the unexpected before it happens. So. I think this still ties in with you being afraid of failure because, you know, you may put a lot of money into a, situ a certain, certain project or situation and you might end up taking a loss for it, but that's okay. It says if you prepare for it, you won't have to be surprised about it. So don't give up on the situation. Don't give up on it. Don't give up on what, are you, what you're trying to do for those of you trying to create a business plan. Do not 
give up on it because it can still work out. Prepare yourself for this unexpected loss. Just prepare yourself, okay? What angels are going to be around you? Let's see. That beautiful. Happy angels. What angels will be around Capricorns this month? That might be the change in transition. Is uh, maybe money loss, perhaps. Spirit, what angels are going to be around Capricorn for the month of November? What angels are going to be around Capricorn? Angel of dreams. So you may see things in your dreams that's giving you fair warning. Um, and look at this, angel of success. At the bottom of the deck. So you got angels of dreams, angels of success that's going to be around you. So you may see, you may receive messages in your dreams about what it is that you need to do in order for you to get to the 10. Which can also break down to a 1 for new beginnings. So pay attention to your dreams. Success is on the way. You may take a loss, but at the same time, you don't have to fully take the loss if you prepare yourself. Okay? Now. Let's see what's happening this month for Capricorns. Ooh, justice is at the bottom of the deck. Capricorns, please. Capricorns. What's happening with Capricorns in November, Spirit? What's happening with Capricorns in November? What's happening with Capricorns in November, please? So we got Knight of Cups in reverse. Strength card. Sorry. Strength card. Eight of Cups in reverse. Eight of Swords. Five of Cups. I feel like you're kicking yourself right now because you didn't move when you were supposed to and now you're taking the loss you regret not moving when you were supposed to move so now yeah you're you're taking this you're taking this loss you ain't taking it very well i tell you that much for others of you um as far as a relationship you're wondering why you didn't leave it alone when you should have and then you regret for that Somebody also doesn't want you to move forward. This Queen of Swords could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Might not want you to move forward. Trying to stop you. Crazy heifer. But you don't want to work together with them. So, let's see what else we got here. For my Capricorn. Some kind of message pissed you off, but it's a good message, though. Or 
you hung up you know, some type of message from somebody that upset you. Hey, guys. Seven of Swords in reverse. Somebody spoke some type of truth to you. Hmm. Huh. Possibly coming back together, but they may have lied. They're unemotionally available. Hmm. Seven of Swords in reverse. Four of Cups. You may be bored with this person's offer. What is this? Yeah, and look, it's at the bottom of the deck, the world card. This shit is over. Like, you, they may have missed an opportunity to um, start over with you or vice versa. Take it out. Resonate. Four of Cups. Yeah, Will of Fortune. Somebody missed the... Okay, somebody might be pissed with you because they received some type of message. <laughs> they received some type of message saying that, you know, whatever opportunity that was there is not. But they also still want a second chance. Somebody wants a second chance with an empress. Um, it could be your child's mother. Um... That may want the second chance. Could be somebody that's pretty much grown since the relationship. But they're but they're confused and in regret. Because of the choice they made in a relationship. In a family. In a relationship and a family situation. Because you walked away. Okay. Alright. Strength card. So you may have ended something that a person didn't want it to be over. Hermit, gain the strength to pretty much go within about about ending this and walking away the cups. Walking away from a family situation. Interesting. Hold up. Oh, this person stuck right in my eye. Hermit. So hermit. That's hermit here. Yep. What the hell? Magician in reverse with the death card. Yeah, you need to not speak to anybody about what it is, what moves you're about to make. Because they're trying to manipulate you into ending something. Ending or releasing something. They may be trying to manipulate you to change and compromise with them. Because their ass is unstable. And they want this new beginning bad. They want to start over with you bad. Ugh. Death card. Death position in reverse. Good grief. Moon card. This is major. You got four damn... Major Arcanas in here. You got Hermit, Magician in Reverse, Death Card, and the Moon. Somebody may be trying to do moon magic on your ass. Four Pentacles as well. They're holding back. Knight of Wands coming in smooth criminal and shit. They may secretly be also trying to come in. Could be a Queen of Cups in Reverse. Somebody that's not emotionally available. A little off. But they may be trying to secretly come in. Um... To make moves so that you can hold back from someone else, possibly. That's if you all are in, in a relationship. But somebody's definitely coming in to manipulate you. Possibly using, um, hate to say it, um, dark magic on you. Capricorns, what the hell? Okay, so this Eight of Cups in reverse, what's this about? Five of Swords. Somebody is jealous and envious. They are mad. Wow. Okay. They don't. Okay. Eight of Cups in reverse. They don't want you to go anywhere. They don't want you to leave. Right. They are jealous. They are envious. They are trying to sabotage 
me show you. They are trying to sabotage this. The Empress. The Empress embodies all four um, elements. The um, Queen of Pentacles, the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Swords. She's like a uh, Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords, Queen of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. Okay. She embodies all of this. So, um, <laughs> this person is trying to sabotage this. They don't want you to go anywhere because there may be an empress coming your way as well that you're going to work. You're going to put the hard work and effort into that relationship. We got four of wands. Okay. You might have a child with this person already, or you and this person may have a child together as you guys, you know, um, work on this. This person may also be pregnant. Eight of Pentacles, you want to work on this with this person. They know that you want to work on this with this person. Ten of Pentacles, see, you guys might end up having a family together. And Two of Cups, this is your soulmate. You got the Four of Wands and the Two of Cups. So this person may be a soulmate of yours. But this, whoever this crazy bitch is, male or female, they don't want you to go anywhere because... And they don't want you to offer anything to this person because they know that you are going to be happy with them. Wow. So somebody's pissed off with you. But they're also they also are confused. They don't understand why you left them. Why you don't want to stay. This is interesting. Five of swords. Six five of swords about swords. Because they're unstable. King of Pentacles in reverse. They're not loyal. Knight of Cups. They come in and out. Like, they're giving you this, like, dumb, shitty type of offer. And you don't want it. They may tell you that they learned their lesson. And they might give you a little offer. But they're, but they're still lying. They're still lying. <sighs> Knight of Cups. And Knight of Cups, King of Pentacles in reverse. They don't want to be there for the long term. Yeah, Eight of Cups, you're walking away. You know this person is unstable. They're not loyal. They don't really want to offer you no love. They just don't want you to be with anybody else. And you're walking away. But they're still confused about the choice you made. <laughs> and why you're moving on. What do you mean? You're not stable. I'm also getting that without you, they're not stable. They're, you know, but but they play too many damn games. Eight of Cups. Eight of Cups, please. Six of Cups. Could be somebody from your past. Could be somebody, like I said, that you have a child with. Um, it could be somebody that you have a child with. Um... But they're thinking about you. They're thinking about you heavily because you are their wish fulfillment. Excuse me. You're their wish fulfillment. They want to come out of the cold with you. But they still going to have you in this third party. Why? Have the cake and eat it too. What's this eight of swords about? Interesting. You go from confused to no longer confused. Hmm. That was quick. This okay, this is this is also what I just got. This person could be like, I'm confused. And you're like, no, you're not. <laughs> you could be like, I mean, I don't understand. Yes, you do. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's what I heard. That's what I got. I don't understand. Yes, you do. Ain't a switch in reverse. I'm confused. You're not confused. Eight of Swords in reverse. <laughs> oh, Nine of Swords in reverse. You're like, but like I said, you go two different ways. 
So it could be like, I'm confused. No, no, you're not. But then you could be like, I don't get it. Wait a minute. Yes, I do. Let, let me, let me, I got to walk away from this shit. Yeah. I mean, it could be like that too. Like you, yeah, one minute you were and the next minute, you know what? All right. I'm getting also that somebody is, somebody may have been sent to jail and they're coming out. So you probably weren't even in there that long. Like, it was some petty stuff, and they pretty much released you. You may have been nervous at one point, but you're not nervous anymore. Like, they already know I didn't do the shit. So, this could be like some, I don't like using this term, but baby mom situation where they try to get you locked up because you decide that you're going to be with somebody else and all that crazy shit. Nine of swords in reverse. But it didn't work. You know what I'm saying? You're no longer juggling your decisions of giving to a situation you're you're not doing that anymore you're not doing it anymore you got new opportunities coming in and you making future plans it may be slightly delayed because you still got a choice to make you haven't i feel like you haven't made this choice yet but you're about to Pick the pentacles Pick the pentacles leaving something out in the cold Five of Pentacles to get the victory and success that you want with this chick butt naked on a horse. All right, five of cups. Five of cups. Okay, <laughs> nine of wands. Somebody feels defeated and they feel like a fool. Nine of wands because this two of cups situation, and I'm sorry that it's so blurred. This two of cups situation is O V E R. You are lame. you are ending this shit. You're like bye, peace out. See you sucker later, loser, leave a dirty. Bon voyage. Kick rocks. Get the hell out. Two of cups in reverse. Stand in your ground. You are confidently ending this bullshit. You're accepting the loss like hey. This could also be somebody regretting ending things with you. And you blocked it, and and you're and they're blocked now. So now they're trying to gain their confidence back. Queen of Wands, Knight of Pentacles, but they be taking a sweet ass time, and by that, and then they cause conflict and shit. And it's and this could also be where a situation where the person always causes problems, and you're taking your power back, Emperor. You're taking your power back. Period. You know this person ain't shit. Uh, what does Capricorn's person want to say to them? What does Capricorn's person want to say to them? What does Capricorn's person want to say to them? What does Capricorn's person want to say to them? Three? Okay. <laughs> okay i'm sorry what's the first card that came out so you talking to somebody else i told you <laughs> but you had me at hello oh my god i'm in love with you oh my god this person is crazy i think about you all day i need a drink asap <laughs> They trying to do magic. They trying to stop you from walking out the door. It's ridiculous. Oh my God. I hope this isn't like a one date person because you need to restrain it order on this person. Messages for Capricorns, my beautiful witches. Thank you. Any other messages for Capricorns for November? Okay, morning, the world awaits you. You got plenty of things going on better than to deal with this shit, okay? Garden, something lovely will grow from this. Something lovely will grow from this disaster and something lovely will grow from this ending. And that will be your two of cups, four of wands, uh, wheel of fortune, this new person that's about to come into your life if they haven't come already. 
And look at that. Great. Endings are inevitable. With a 37 at the top, which breaks down to a 10. Oh my God, Becky. Okay? This ending is bound to happen and it's destined to happen. Okay? Flowers. Flower witches. Be honest with yourself. This shit is over and they're crazy. You let this go. Oh my God, Capricorns. That is your reading for the uh, month of November. I will be back later in the month with more information <laughs> for you guys. Please make sure you like, share, comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell for when I upload. All further information is in the um, description box below. Um, and I will talk to you again very soon. Bye, Cappies.